The NVIDIA Control Panel is a piece of software that gets put on your Windows 10 computer when you install the NVIDIA Graphics Driver. It is a tool that lets you change your graphics settings to make your games look better or run much faster. There are many things that can stop NVIDIA Control Panel from opening, such as a driver that isn't working right or files that are missing. We've listed the things you can try to fix this problem in this video. Fix number one, restart your computer. Before trying any of the troubleshooting steps listed below, you should restart your computer. This action restarts the operating system and gets rid of any corrupt temporary data that could be causing a problem. Fix number two, reinstall the latest GPU drivers. The next best thing you need to do is reinstall the graphics driver, since the problem is usually caused by files that aren't working right. Press the Windows plus R keys then type the EVMGMTMSC. This will open the Device Management Console. In the Device Manager, expand the Display Adapters then right-click on your NVIDIA adapter under this category and click on Install and check Delete the Driver Software for this device and then OK to remove the drivers. Visit the NVIDIA Driver page and search for your graphics card drivers under the option 1, Manually Find Drivers. You have to provide your graphics card type, OS, and other relevant information and then click the search after you are provided with the latest driver for your card, download it. Go to the download location of the driver and launch the installer. While installing, select Custom Options and select Clean Install. This will further wipe previous installations and install the latest working version. Afterwards, restart your computer and check for the problem. Fix number 3. Enable the NVIDIA Display Driver Service Some users were able to successfully fix their NVIDIA control panel issues by ensuring that the NVIDIA Display Driver Service is running and not currently disabled. To check if that's the case in your computer, follow these steps. Press Windows plus R keys on your keyboard to open the run prompt. Type services.msc and hit enter. This will open the services console. In the Services window, search for NVIDIA Display Container LS and double-click it. Set the startup type to automatic and then start the service if it's been stopped. Repeat this for other NVIDIA-related services. Fix number 4. Restart the NVIDIA Control Panel Process Another simple trick that you can do here is to refresh the NVIDIA Control Panel Process. Here are the steps that you need to do. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus S on your keyboard to launch the Task Manager. Click on More Details and select the Processes. Under this tab, search for the NVIDIA Control Panel. Right-click on it and select End Task. Try this for other NVIDIA processes. Head over to your desktop or Start menu and launch the Control Panel again. Fix number 5. Check the Registry. Checking your computer's registry is the next solution that you need to try at this point. If you have no idea how to do this, check out these steps. Press the Windows key plus R to open the run prompt. Type regedit and hit enter to open the registry editor. Once the registry editor is open, go to HKEYCLSSES root, directory, background, context menu handler. Locate NVCPL desktop context, right click on it and select delete. Go to HKEYCLSSES root, directory, background, shell. Right click on shell and add a new key with the name NVIDIA control panel. Right-click on NVIDIA Control Panel and add a new key with the name command. Double-click on the default value, provide the key C, Windows, System32, and VCPLUI.exe and click OK. Restart the computer. Fix number 6. Update the .NET Framework and VC++ Redistributable. .NET Framework and VC++ Redistributable are two programs are needed for NVIDIA to work without any problems. Press the Start button, type Windows Updates, press Enter, and then click the Search for Updates button to run a Windows update. If a new version of the .NET Framework or VC++ Redistributable is available, it will be downloaded and installed. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.